hello guys greetings welcome to vinyl tv if you are new to this channel and if you are please consider subscribing i want to show you this is my washing machine bush washing machine All right. um as you know i bought a new house and uh, it happens that where the washing machine space is is totally different to where the tap is so basically the tap is here okay so the tap is here so you can see it's a bit of a gap you know so but what we're going to do now i want to show you how um to connect the water feed okay the water feed is underneath here okay i'm gonna bring the camera back a little bit to show you so you can see the water feed the waste feed basically is here so what we need to do right now is to connect this wet waste feed right to with extension so we are going to connect this waste feed with an extension and see if it works so what we are going to do is connecting the waste feed So this is the extension I bought this online okay so we're going to connect this hose and see if it works okay so this this is what we're going to do right now um, this is this is uh, jubilee clip Okay. This is this this round thing is called Jubilee clip. So you can see another one here already. So what we're going to do is to connect this hose into this. Okay. And Going to do is to connect this source. Okay. So this. So connect the two together and stick it in. So stick it in. and try to bring back the jubilee clip and see if this work I'll try to 
lose this jubilee clip So trying to lose it. This round hose is called Jubilee Cleave. Going to now tighten this up as far as you can. see if it works what I'm doing now is to tighten the knot tightening the jubilee clip to the waist feed and make sure it's tight properly so that the water will not go off so this kind of is something to hold it steady Okay. And uh, so basically, then we take this hose. I still got another Jubilee clip here in case if I need it, you know, I can still put it here, you know. So that what I'm just making sure is there will be no leakage on this. So tighten it properly as far as you can go, okay? Now, and once you've done that, what we need to do is to take this hose, you can see where it is. So uh, put it underneath, okay? and put this underneath right and so we what we're going to do is there is a if you see there is a hole here where to feed the hose through so what we're going to do is to feed this waste feed through the hole here, okay. So feed the waste hole, water waste hose, feed it in the hose provided. And Now, what we're going to do is to connect this host host up. So it's going to this place here. This is where it's going. 
So I uh, need to put in the second Ghibli clip to the second section of here. Okay, and open it up a little bit so, so that it will go. So once it's in, you'll tie it. So what we're going to do is to stick it in here. see it's in okay it's in so I'm not a, a plumber but uh, I'm doing this you know DIY do it by yourself so I'm trying to sort this out by myself and see if it work so you can see that that waste feed is here so it's connected to this section here so this is where it's going I hope you can see it right so um so i'm gonna do is to tighten it up with the jubilee clip okay so and see if it stay um stay like this hopefully it will stay so tighten the jubilee clip up so you do this with a flat screwdriver so i bought this waste feed hose from amazon online it was delivered to my home address it's something that uh, we wouldn't have this problem if the house designer you know they put the washing machine very close but it doesn't matter so uh, you know uh, it's something that you know uh, to be mindful and something to think about if you are moving home or if you are buying a house so uh, by this place I got washing machine you know so there's no need to There's no need to get a, you know, get rid of that washing machine. So I need to find a way to bring my old washing machine in here in, to this new property. Basically, that's what it is. So what we're trying to do now is to make sure the jubilee clip is tightening up a little bit. So. To the horse yeah so what we are going to do is to tighten this up got another screwdriver here this up hopefully So guys, I hope you can see what I'm doing. It's a very awkward position, but we are getting there. Okay, yeah. So yes, that is it, guys. So this is what I've done. So I connected the hose from from the bottom here. You know. Connected this hose to the water 
feed connection so the waste will go through here and the water will drain through the pipe so I uh, just thought to show you you know what I've done um, just so this is how to you know I bought a uh, water uh, waste feed from the washing machine for washing machine so you can see this this blue horse here is for the water but this one is for the waste so I'm gonna check if it works okay if you are new to this channel guys if you are happy with what I've shown you how to connect um, your waste washing machine waste feed give this video a thumb up share it with your friends and family it's just um, you know sort of a uh, bought a house and it happened that the washing machine space is totally different to the where they got the water system is so i need to basically i bought a station hose to be able to connect this you know and see if it works okay thank you very much and uh, please consider subscribing to vinyl tv thank you and god bless you